Hello, I'm Lee Darcy and welcome to the Bell Bay Aluminium Smelter. The Bell Bay Aluminium Smelter is located on the Kanamaluka Tama River in northern Tasmania. The nearest town to our Bell Bay Aluminium Smelter is Georgetown, five kilometres to the north on the coast. At Bell Bay Aluminium, 514 employees work here, plus 100 contractors on any given day. We are one of the largest employees here in northern Tasmania. The smelter opened in 1955. As the official opening day arrives, Minister for Supply, the Honourable Howard Beale, presses a button and production begins. We're the first aluminium smelter in the Southern Hemisphere. We were established to overcome the dependence on import of aluminium into Australia. Bell Bay was chosen as the best site because of its deep water port availability and access to clean renewable hydroelectricity. In our first year of operation, we produced just 1,200 tonnes of aluminium. Now, we produce around 190,000 tonnes each year. On the world stage, our smelter is relatively small, but we've learned to use this to our advantage. We work more closely with our customers and are more flexible with product development. The majority of our metal is cast to customer requirements as pure aluminium or aluminium alloys used in the transport, construction, packaging and electrical industries. More than 90% of Bell Bay's value-added production is transported off the island and exported to key international markets, predominantly in Southeast Asia, East Asia and India. Aluminium is now more than ever the metal of the future. By working in partnership with our customers, anticipating market developments and thinking innovatively, Bell Bay positions itself for sustainable success. Innovation is at the core of what we do. We continue to invest in a range of leading technologies and we're always looking for ways to do things better. We strive to become more energy efficient, increase our productivity and reduce our use of natural resources. As an example, we've embraced the new generation fluor design in our carbon bacon furnace. This innovation reduces our gas consumption by 30% per baked tonne of carbon. Currently, we are the only smelter in the world using this technology. We've embraced smart technologies. Our key automation projects have resulted in greater process and energy efficiencies. Our autonomous vehicles, Wally and R2D2, transport product from the cast house to the warehouse every day. That's over 40,000 tonnes of aluminium being moved by our AGVs each year. Here at Bell Bay we work together with other organisations and businesses to minimise our waste and repurpose our byproducts that's created by the smelting process. As an example, we send our spent cell lining, also known as SEL, to Cement Australia, which is based in Railton, northern Tasmania, in purpose-built trailers which tend to send about four to 6,000 tonne of this material each year. So this spent cell lining is used at Cement Australia as an alternate fuel source for them in their process. We hold a tree planting day with schools in the Georgetown community each year. This initiative provides an opportunity for the students to learn of the importance of tree planting to the environment, the climate and their local community. To date, we have planted more than 30,000 native trees, including oak, eucalypt, swamp paper bark, and Banksia trees with students from the nearby Launceston and Tamar Valley region. We have a long and proud history of contributing to the Tasmanian community through enduring relationships built on mutual respect, collaboration and genuine partnership. Bell Bay's Community Grants Program offers assistance annually to community-based groups and organisations across Tasmania. We provide financial support to organisations that positively support the Tasmanian community in key social, environmental and economic focus areas. Our role in economic and social development focuses on strategic initiatives that support opportunities for the future. By supporting the community we operate in, in this way, we will attract people to invest, work and come and live in this beautiful part of Tasmania. For example, we have partnered with Georgetown Council and the Australian Government to develop the Georgetown Mountain Bike Trails. With 80 kilometres over two world-class trails, Mount George and Tipagori Hills, we have provided access to land owned by the smelter for approximately half of the trail network. So what we've shown you today, it's fair to say our economic and social contribution since 1955 in Tasmania has been vast. While we're proud of what we've achieved, we're focused on building a strong and sustainable future. On behalf of the Bell Bay team, thank you for watching.